But hey, y'all, welcome to a Saturday Suds on Uncle Bubba's Bell Buckle Beer Reviews. And what I've got to, for you today um, is the last, well, I'm going to say it's the last, but it's uh, the third of the Sierra Nevada uh, mixed 12 pack I got. And it's a sunny little thing, citrus wheat ale at a 5% ABV. All right, so this, uh, this is something I've never tried before. Um, of course, it, it gives me the government warning and alcohol by volume, but it doesn't really say, you know, what kind of hops it used or anything like that. It just says citrus wheat ale. Now, uh, I'm taking that the citrus is going to come from the hops. The, the citrus is that it's coming from the hop flavor, but I like a good wheat ale. And a lot of people don't care for them. I like a wheat. I like a wheat ale. They're just good to me. Um, Hefeweizen and stuff like that. Anyway, we're going to try this uh, Sierra Nevada sunny little thing today on a Saturday Suds. So it's a sunny little thing Saturday. And man, that stuff is bright as it can be. Look how pale that is. Beautiful gold, let's do a yellow color. Well, it don't look yellow on the camera. Dad it. It don't look yellow on the camera there, but looking at it through the, looking at, at the light through it, it's got just a tad of haze to it. But man, it looks a bright yellow. <clears throat> Not detecting any kind of aroma off that head. Mmm. Oh wow. Boy, I got a I got a zesty zesty little tartness off that head. Wow. That is is uh unique. So, I got I couldn't get any aroma off the head, but when I took a sip of that head, um I got just a hint of tartness. And, and a, a fruity zestiness out of that head there. It was almost like a, wasn't hardly a lemon, uh, but it, it's fruity. I mean, I can see where they get the citrus out of it uh, as far as the head goes. I'm going to tell you what it tastes like. It tastes... <laughs> Silly Rabbit tricks are for kids. This stuff tastes like trick cereal. It, the the head does. The head tastes like a tricks, the fruity flavor you get in like a trick cereal. <laughs> I'm not kidding y'all. That's the flavor I'm getting out of the head. And just a little bit of tartness on top of that. Um, Cause when I first took a sip, I was like, wow, that's something I'm not used to having the flavor in beer like that. But that's what it tastes like. It tastes like a, a trick cereal. The flavor. And the head. And just a little bit of tartness. Alright, so huh, that's unique. And I gave the I gave the can a good swish before I poured the rest of it in there, and that hazed it up just a little bit. But it's still just a beautiful brew. Beautiful brew. 5% ABV. Sunny little thing by Sierra Nevada. So this uh citrus wheat ale is for all american workers hey i love and appreciate y'all thank you for the hard work that you do day in and day out to provide for yourselves and your families pay your own way and support our economy um i know what it's like y'all i work hard to, to make ends meet and provide for my family uh, so i appreciate what y'all do cheers brothers and sisters Man, that is really good. All right, so I'm not getting the trick cereal flavor out of the body of it. Thank goodness. That kind of concerned me for a minute. But what I am getting, I get, I get, I get more of a lemony, just a, just a very slight lemony flavor, and then I can also taste the wheat in the beer. 
It's it's a it's a wheaty, bready type. It's it's not real strong. I'm not getting overwhelmed by it, but I'm getting just that little bit of a lemon zest type flavor and the, just a wheat white bread type flavor as well in this brew. That's what I'm getting, and it's good. <laughs> it is really good. It's very mild, very easy to drink. Oh, very, very pleasant. Very pleasant. Man, the, all right, so this is, it's different from anything I've had because I'm not used to having that. Usually when I have a wheat beer, right, I've been used to having wheat beers that, that have just a little bit of tartness to them occasionally. This one has, it, the tartness is, is, is almost non-existent. What I'm getting is a lemony, a lemony zest, very light lemony zest flavor. And then the, the, the backup wheat white bread flavor oh. with it as well. It's something totally different from anything I've ever tried. I really like this. Um, very mild and easy to drink. And just a very pleasant, un, unexpected flavor uh, that I'm getting out of it, too. I'm going to score this one an A-. minus. Um, simply because uh, for a wheat ale, it's... it's it's good, all right. It's it's a good brew. Um, I'm gonna score an A minus. I'm I'm really surprised I like it as much as I do. But this is a flavor that I was not expecting, uh, and, and I really like it. It's it's good brew. A minus on this one, y'all. If you get a chance to try one of these uh, Sierra Nevada uh, mixed twelve packs. They've got four different beers, three of each one in this 12 pack. And I think I give I give like 19 bucks for the 12 pack, I think. But I'm not sorry I did. I mean it's got it's got the big little thing at a nine percent, uh the hazy little thing, I can't remember what the ABV is in it, and then the the wild little thing is a five point five, single little thing is a five. Um I'm not sorry I'm got I got this twelve pack because I've got some more of these to enjoy. Uh, now the the wild little thing I'm gonna save for my wife. She, I think she'll enjoy them more than I will. <laughs> but the rest of them I'm gonna enjoy them because this is good brew right here. Very good A minus quality brew. Nice lacing, beautiful, a little bit of haze. Get a chance to try it. Give it a shot. Um, all right, y'all. So that's been a sunny little thing Saturday on Uncle Bub's Bell Buckle Bear Reviews this week. I'll be back uh, next week. Um, so y'all stay tuned. Take care. Love and appreciate y'all. Cheers.